I'm not gonna lie, I did not know I had this much stuff for you. Like, I knew I had a lot of stuff, but not this much stuff. <laughs> What's up, you guys? It's your girl Trinity. If you're new here, hi, I'm Trinity Kamaya. If you're not new, welcome back to my channel. As y'all read by the title, I am doing a puppy haul, which I'm so, so excited about because I've been manifesting in this puppy ever since last year of 2022. Like, some of this stuff that I have right now, I done had since June of 2022, and it's literally may of 2023 so i'm so excited to share everything that i got for him um if you don't know i'm getting a yorkie he's a chocolate yorkie to be exact and i'm so excited to get him so let's go ahead and do this puppy haul so let's get into the video okay so like i said some of this stuff i did have since last year because like i said i knew i was going to get a puppy but i didn't know when but I got some of this stuff because some of the stuff that I have now is not in store, so I'm so happy I got. So if you're getting a puppy and you got some of your stuff in early or whatever, no judge because like I said, I had some of this stuff since last year and I'm finally getting my puppy. But I'm trying to figure out where I should start at because some people do essentials first and then food or treats. But me personally, I think I'm just gonna go ahead and just do store by store so y'all can just see everything that I got from these different stores. So let's go ahead and start with let's go ahead and start with Dollar Tree. Since it's right here, let's go ahead and start with Dollar Tree. This stuff that I got him is probably basically like just containers. Can't even open the bag. Hold on. Okay, so I got this. This is where I'm gonna put his treat bags in or whatever. I don't know why I got these. I just think I just got overexcited, but I don't regret getting this though. Everything that I got here, especially since last year, I don't regret. But it says chilling with my dogs, and this is so cute. Um, but I'm thinking about just going ahead and just putting his treat bags in here. That's probably what I'm going to do. But other than that, I got this from Dollar Tree. And then I got two of these. These are for basically, I'm going to put his food in here. Like if we're going out of town or whatever. And I need to put his food in a small container. This is going to be where I put his food at. So I got two. I think I had bought one for my mom. Cause I didn't know she was gonna get her puppy, but since not, I just got two. So it says you have me at Wolf, which is so cute. So yeah, these are where I'm gonna put his food at, especially if he's like somebody's dog sitting here or whatever, and I'm about to drop him off. That's for that. And then I think we, oh no, it's not the last thing. I got this from Dollar Tree, y'all. Look at this. This is from Dollar Tree. It's like basically a puzzle where you put his treats or his like kibbles in. It's so cute and they just have to move it. It helps with their mind and everything. So I had got this for a dollar and 25 cents because I forgot the dollar and 25 cents store. But this is so cute. Hopefully they still, I don't know if they still got these in store, but if they do, make sure y'all go purchase this if y'all got a dog because once he learned this, I'm going to upgrade it to um, a more better one, but I just want to see if he likes this. And don't mind me if my allergies is messing up because y'all know it's spring, so I'm sorry. But this is the last thing I got from Dollar Tree. It's a little poop bag. I thought these were so cute, so I decided to get these. So this stuff I got from Dollar Tree, I got last year. <laughs> Not gonna lie. But yeah, this is so cute, and I really like this the little paw print. So that's what I got from Dollar Tree. So let's go ahead and I'm gonna sit this inside because I do this. So let's go ahead and do Marshall's. I thought this was so cute. This is like his first toy I ever got him. So it's Doggerade. It's so, so cute. I think this squeeze. 
it squeaks. So this is so cute, it says Doggeray. The next thing I have, oh my gosh, I love this. This is my, out of all his toys, like he has so many toys, but out of all his toys, this one is my favorite. They don't sell these in stores no more because I got these toys last year. So they don't sell these shoes, no, um, not shoes. <laughs> they don't sell these toys no more, this toy no more. So I'm so happy I got this because this is my favorite toy. Look at this, his own little shoe. And it says Bugs Bunny. I'm so happy I got this because this is so, so cute. And I just love this sound. Like, I love the crinkle sound. I don't really, I'm not a squeaky person. Like, I don't like the squeaky toys. But for a dog owner, I love the um, crinkle toys. So, hopefully, he likes it. And I think it squeaks as well. It squeaks as well. But, yeah, this is my favorite toy. And I love this toy so much. It's from Space Jam. So, I love this toy so much. Alright, so let's go ahead and do the next one. Mm hmm. Let's go ahead and do oh yeah. This one I just recently got from Bells. And this is pet wipes. These ones like how much was these? I don't even know if it says it on here. But these are oh it says right here. It's $4.99 for five dollars basically. The pet wipes. I wish it was in backwards. I don't know if I can read it, but these are the pet wipes, and it comes with ten travel packs, and it's like literally a hundred in here. So these I loved, and I like it because it's come with like individual, so it's like you don't have to open it and pull it out. You can just open, open it, open the pack, and then pull out the wipe. So these are really good for like travels and everything. Especially if I'm taking him on a walk, I can have his pet wipes just in case he steps in something that he's not supposed to be stepping in. So, I love this. This is actually a good price, and I'm happy I got these. Okay, and then next. Oh, let's go ahead and do five and below. I think this is the only thing I got for five and below, which is his toy. I feel like this one was actually a good toy for his teething and everything and to clean his teeth. This, I think this squeaks as well. Got this for like $4 at five and below. It's really cute. And y'all, uh, y'all see what I'm talking about right there. I actually like this toy. It's really cute. And hopefully he likes it. Then, let's go ahead and do Ralph. Oh, this right here. I think I got this earlier this year. I don't know. But I'm happy I got this because they don't even sell this no more at Ralph. They have these other ones, which I really don't like, but it's this, a retractable dog leash, and I'm so happy I got this because they don't even sell them in stores no more. That's why I said, if you are getting a puppy, I don't even care if you're getting a puppy next year. Sometimes it's okay to just shop early, just manifest. It's okay to shop early if you know that you're going to get a puppy because once I started getting all his stuff, I knew that I wanted a puppy literally so that's why i'm so happy i got this because some of the stuff that i got from last year or earlier this year they don't have it now so you're getting a puppy make sure that you're just getting like small small little bit don't matter if you're getting the next year i'm not gonna judge but make sure you just go ahead and just get little by little but this right here is so cute and i love it take it out like that so cute so that i got from ralph okay let's see what's next um y'all my allergies are messing up okay so let's go ahead and do sheen okay, so let's start off with this this is for like when he goes outside and then he come back in and I just clean his paws while he just came from outside. So it's like a little soft bristle or whatever. So cute. I thought this was so cute and it's cheap because you know she is very, very cheap. So I got this for that to clean his paws when he come from outside. And then I love this so much. This little lick mat. It has dog bones on it. I thought this was so cute. I think I could pay like like $3 for this. 
So this is basically because I work from home. So when I work from home, I don't want him to be barking or anything else because I know he's going to want attention. So I'm going to just put this in his playpen or whatever and I'm put peanut butter on it as well so he can lick it and be able to get his mind off of me and just focus on the peanut butter. So that's what I got from Shane. And then this right here, I think I'm about to stand up, but this, as y'all can tell, is really, really big. This is for his playpen. It, I think it's washable. Yeah, it's washable. This is for his playpen, and to be honest, it fits right in his playpen. It literally fits right in his playpen. So I'm so happy I got this size. I think I got like an extra large, but it's so cute, and it fits right in his playpen. Okay, and then last but not least, <laughs> this is so cute. This is his bathtub. Perfect size for him. It comes with this at the bottom, so I can see. Um, so I can open it up and drain the water out and everything. That's what it comes in. And then that too so this was actually a good price for this because amazon i seen on amazon they had it for more expensive to be honest with you like all jokes aside amazon is kind of cheap but sometimes in stores is more cheaper just like pet smart pet smart will rob your money but if you go on like amazon or in marshall's or whatever tj maxx it's more cheaper so i got this for probably $16 which is not bad because on Amazon I think it was like 30 like 30 for this but and it was the same size same brand everything but this is so cute I'm happy I got this so this is in the style too okay so that's everything from Sheen hmm I'm trying to see what I need to do next from the store because like I said he has a lot of stuff a lot of um let's go ahead and do i'm gonna do um i forgot i had this over here i'm gonna do tj maxx this is his first i love this so much this is his first teddy bear as y'all can see his first teddy bear um i don't think it's always a squeeze it squeeze and then, like I said, it comes in the way you can bite on this thing. But this is so cute. Like, he is so adorable. I was going to get him a snuggle puppy. But right now, since he has so much stuff, I decided not to get him a snuggle puppy, even though I want to. But I'm just going to get it for him for Christmas. That's the plan. Let's get it for him for Christmas because I decided not to get it for him right now. So hopefully, this one actually calm his nerves. And everything especially when i leave his first day here so hopefully he enjoys this one but i like this one he's so cute and it's it was like 49 nights like five dollars and some change and then last thing i got from tj maxx i think i think this is the last thing it's his food and water bowl i did buy i previously bought him a food and water bowl from burlington but i'm gonna take it back because I decided I like this one better. And my mama said this one looks more boring. So this one is cute. I really like this. It's wooden and everything. Love it. Come with stainless steel. I feel like this is so cute for him. I'm making a black noise. But this is so cute for him. And like I said, it's a good height for him since he's going to be a puppy. In the future, I might actually upgrade his food and water bro because... Um, he's gonna probably be more bigger than this. I don't know. He's a Yorkie, so I don't know how tall or you know how big he's gonna get. Hopefully, cause he's supposed to be around like four to six pounds. So if he can still have this, then he gonna still use it. So that's all I got from Burlington. So let's put this to the side. Um. Let's go ahead. I got this over here, but I don't know if I want to show y'all right now. But I'm going to go ahead and show y'all Walmart. This is what I got from Walmart. 
So I got this little tug of war for when I play. I heard, actually, I heard this is not a good toy for dogs. But I don't know. It's like a lot of mixed comments saying it is good for dogs. It's not good for dogs. So I heard that, I guess, if they pull on this too hard and they swallow it, they can get sick. So it's like I'm a little iffy about it. So I don't know if I'm going to give this to him. But then again, we're just going to have to see. I don't know. Like, some of the stuff, if he don't use some of his toys, I'm just going to donate them. Like, I'm just going to donate him, especially his clothes and everything else that he can't fit or wear. But this is what I got from Walmart. And then I got, this is so cute. I don't even know if I want to get him this blanket because it's, I don't know. I think I'm going to still get him this blanket because I'm going to be honest with you. He has three blankets because I was going to leave one in the car, one in his playpen, and then one in my living room. But I forgot that my breeder is giving me a blanket with all his litter mates and his mom sent on and everything because he has a brother and a sister. He was the smallest one when he was born, so so I don't know. I might just go ahead and just put this in his um little bin because he does have like a bin area and everything. Like he has the storage area, so I'm probably gonna put this in his bin. And if he gets one dirty or keep peeing on it and I can't wash it no more, then I'm gonna just give this to him. But this is a baby blanket basically, but it's a dog blanket because I want him to be comfortable and everything. And then, and then I got him this blanket because it was on sale. I'm not gonna lie, it was seventy five fifty cents. So I like this one. I might put this over his playpen. I don't know because I forgot I do need to put a blanket over his playpen so at nighttime he'll be warm and everything or chill or whatever. And it'll help him with the lights and stuff so he can go to sleep. But this is his blanket, which is so cute. Um, and then, these are Christmas toys, which is on sale. So cute. Got him a little reindeer. I got all these squeaky toys, which I kind of regret, but anything for my baby. But this is cute. And then I got him this little snowman. But like I said, I love um squishy toys as a dog owner. That's loud, but this is a little snowman. Okay, and then let's go ahead. Oh wait, I'm not doing Walmart. I think I have it over here too. This is his bed. Oh my gosh, I forgot his um his name tag stuff is in here. But this is his bed I got for Christmas as well. Cause he was like 50, 75% off. I love this bed so much. And you can literally flip it over and stuff. But this is so cute. I love this bed. I'm not gonna lie, he might get this for Christmas. <laughs> But I don't know yet. I don't know yet. But I love this bed. I love this bed so much. And then this bed is temporary. I'm not going to lie. The reason why I said temporary because I don't want to put a cute bed in his playpen. And he just pee on it. Because I know he's going to be peeing in his playpen. Which I'm going to have play pads in there. But this is a temporary bed. Because I know he's going to be peeing on, it, peeing on it. Hopefully he don't. But if he do, this is temporary. And I could just throw it away once he's fully probably trained but as you can see this is three dollars is a sale that's why i said some of this stuff i got last year because it was either on sale or i knew it wasn't going to be in stores anymore but this was three dollars as y'all can see and this is the temporary bed that it will be in his playpen because i'm not going to put him in a cage i'm not gonna lie i was but then my boyfriend was like no <laughs> He was like, no, he don't want him in the cage because he don't want him to feel, like, locked up or whatever. So, a playpen actually sounds better because he'll have more room and more space and everything. So, got this bed for him. So, that's it from Walmart. His name tag. Um, This is his collar, which I feel like it's too small. So, once I put this on him, when I pick him up, and if it's too small, too tight, then I'm just going to go to the store and buy him a 
bigger size collar because I got this for like a dollar because it was on sale. So at the end of the day, I'm probably gonna donate it or whatever. I don't know. But his name tag, I really don't want y'all to see his name. So if y'all want to see his name or know what his name is, y'all gonna have to just watch my puppy video when I pick him up. But it's so cute and I can't wait to show y'all. Okay, so that's it for Walmart. So what I have left is Amazon, Chewy, and Burlington. But I do have PetSmart as well, which is only one thing in here, which I got for Halloween. Candy corn. That is so cute. So I had to go get it. So this is from PetSmart. That's the only thing I got from PetSmart. Um, so I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to show y'all his harnesses, which I'm so excited about. So let's go ahead and show his harnesses this is the first harness that i got and this is from sassy Wolf, which hopefully i can partner with them or whatever hopefully they can sponsor us and everything but this is his harness got this for christmas it's so cute now, i'm not gonna lie i did ask like people that have yorkies or whatever i did ask like what size harnesses they have majority of them have extra extra small and this is what it is an extra extra small and literally all of them have extra extra small so what i saw i was like okay and plus it's adjustable you can adjust it whatever it is. so i made sure i got the right size before i bought it but this is so cute like oh my gosh so cute and i'm the type of person that okay you're just getting one harness and that's it because it's a harness it's a harness but now since i'm looking at sassy wolf and hopefully they can sponsor us and you know now it's like i need to buy more than one harness because they're so cute and it's, if one gets dirty put on another one and then i got this as well which is like a poop bag holder and it does have a poop bag in it so cute so adorable so happy that i got this um and the reason why i got this too for like around christmas time is because Sassy Wolf, once they have stuff posted, sometimes they don't have it next year or the following year. So they actually brought this pattern back. So I had to get it. I really had to get it. So the next one that I got from Sassy Wolf, he has two harnesses. He's so cute. It's the milk and cookies one. Oh my gosh. When I tell you I was so in love with this one, like I had to get it. This is so cute, so, so cute. So I can't wait to take pictures of him in it, but it's so adorable. This is the side. Okay, so the next thing I'm going to do, um, I'm going ahead and do Burlington. Like I said, he has a blanket, but it was on sale for like $3.99. But this blanket is so soft, so cute. So had to get it and then he has these are what i got last year because it was on sale this was 199 don't know if y'all can see it but it was 199 it's a little taco so cute and then i have the little chocolate how do you say it chocolate chip <laughs> that's what i have and this squeaks, but it's like a little small squeak. Like, it's not like a big, big squeak. It's like, see? Yeah. I'm gonna like this toy. But this is so cute. And then I got him for the ice cream cone. I thought this was the cutest thing. The ice cream cone. This don't squeak, which I'm so happy about. This does not squeak. But it's so cute. Like, all his toys are so cute. And he has different varieties of toys. Some don't squeak. Some squeaks. And some crinkle. And then I think I recently, I recently just got this one for Easter. The squeaks. I thought it was so cute. It looks like a girl toy, but he won't know. But it's so cute. And I thought it was so cute because of the little donut. And then, I think the last toy that I got was this toy. 
so cute. And I think um, once he come home, I'm going to put some toys out that I feel like he can, you know, play with at his age. And then after that, I'm going to bring, like, some more toys in because I'm done. I'm not buying him no more toys. I think he has 12 toys. <laughs> Literally, he's spoiled. So, this is cute. Okay. And then let's go ahead and do this bag over here in Burning City. This big bag. All right, this is his. Um, it says a travel bowl mat, but this is his food mat. It says bark, so cute, so adorable. This is where I'm gonna put his the food and water bowl that y'all just see. I'm gonna put this on here, and then this is the bowl that I said I was going to return because I don't want it anymore. This is what it looks like, but I'm returning it. Comment down below which bowl that y'all actually like because I'm not gonna lie, I like the other one better. And then I got his towels, which is not a bad deal. It's two for $5.99. So it's not a bad deal because I wanted him to have two towels anyways. So this is cute, as y'all can see. And it's from Sharper Image. And then last but not least, I got this, a urine destroyer. It's so cute. I never heard of this brand, but it was $3.99. So I never heard of this brand, but it's supposed to help. And it says you buy, we donate, they eat. So I'm the type of person that likes to donate when it comes to dog that's why i said some of the stuff that he don't you know play with or can't wear anymore i'm gonna donate so i wanted to buy this so hopefully this actually helps hopefully it helps when if he does hopefully he don't pee on my carpet but if he do spray this so that's from that bag that i'm gonna finish this and then the last thing from burlington that started it all that started it all of me buying stuff so early for him was this bed i literally called my mom and was like this bed is so cute should i get it <laughs> I'm like this bed is so cute like just look at it and it kind of match with my house as well so this bed is so cute and this probably gonna be the bed that's gonna be sitting in my room or the living room i don't know but i thought this bed was so cute so i just to get this bed and i know it goes inside out as well so it goes in as y'all can see it on the like that so that's what started it all after i bought this bed i just bought a lot of stuff <laughs> literally which i do not regret right and then amazon like this video is so long, y'all. I don't know if I want to make a part one or part two, but I'm just going to show y'all what I got for him for Amazon. So let's go ahead and start off with this. I got this for him. I forgot what it's called, but basically you fill it up with water and then this is where you put his treats at. Like if you're going on a trip or anything, or if you're going to the dark park or anything, the beach, you can just like twist this it twists some of them don't twist some of them you like go up and down with or whatever but this twist you just give them the water and then if you want to stop the water you just pull it up and then boom bam i love this i thought it was so cute because look at this i'm gonna call it ears but look at the little ears it's so cute i actually love this so much and they're supposed to keep it cold the little frosted supposed to keep it cold Okay, and then I got this, the bath brush. But when he take a bath, I have the bath brush with, um, to bathe him with or whatever. And I got this from TikTok. Um, I'm following somebody and they recommend getting this. And then I got him. <laughs> Don't judge y'all. I got him a toy because I heard this toy was actually a good toy for them. So I got this toy for him. And then I got, ooh, 
I got this for him. It's just this comb for his like hair and everything. And then this too for his little stains. If he has stains, I can just wipe it off or whatever, comb it. These two. All this is from Amazon. Same package and everything. And this. And this was actually cheap. I think this was like $4.99. I think. I think $4.99, $5.99. But this was actually a good price for this. So when you get that bag to make sure. Oh. And then this. This is conditioning detangling spray. It's from BioSilk. Don't know if y'all can see. But this is supposed to be basically detangle him. Like once he get out the bathtub or whatever, I'm gonna spray it on him, brush it, everything. It'll smell so good. And then I got this grooming kit. Cause I'm happy I got this one. This is like, just in case I comb him and then you have to see the little, the little bristles or whatever. I don't know if y'all can. There we go. And then once I brush him, if he has hair or whatever, I can just do it like that. And it's easy to clean. And it came with this to clip his nails with. I'm going to try to speed it up because it's a long video. And then I got this. The little balm. The little coconut paw balm his paws like when he go outside and it's too hot or too cold probably won't use them he got the bathtub as well to keep him fresh and then i got this which is the oatmeal shampoo and conditioner this is what i'm going to be using for him so and it's supposed to stop itching and freshening and condition with oatmeal and baking soda so hopefully it works and i got this from tiktok as well it's a doggy milk milk bath, which is so cute. You just pour it in the bathtub, make him feel more relaxed, and go to sleep. <laughs> so I got this for him. And then I got this indoor camera. I got this indoor camera for him because once I leave to go to class or to work study, I want to make sure that he's okay make sure he's breathing so that's why i got this for when i leave to go somewhere and then i got this food dog food this is so cute he holds 10 pounds but his dog food is like six pounds and it comes in a little scoop which is so cute and tiny and this is how it looks inside so this is dog food. I'll put all his dog food stuff in. So this is dog food container. And then let's go ahead. This is where I put all his toys at. I got this from, from I think Black Friday, which is not bad. This is where I put all his toys at. Cause like I said, he has so many toys, literally so many toys. And then let's go ahead. This I'm so excited about. This is car seat. Everybody has this car seat that is basically has like paw prints on it. It's black. I don't like it. And plus, everybody got it. So I decided to get this because I feel like it's more better. And like, if you want your dog to sit up, it'll like literally sit up in the car so they can look outside the window. And I think this is so cute. And it comes with it. Um, it's an easy setup as well. Like, it's really an easy setup. So it comes with this, which I think is so cute. Like, when you put all his, like, little small poop bags in or whatever. And it comes with the little poop bags. And it comes with this too, which I am going to leave this in here just in case. Because we're on the road and I forgot his thing. I have this on the side. Especially for his food in here too. So I feel like that's so cute. And this is a great deal for Black Friday. <laughs> Literally. And then let's go ahead and 
this is his little bag where I'm going to bring with me to pick him up in. And I'm going to just bring this for me, like, if I'm going out of town or anything, or if I'm running errands, I'm, I'm going to bring this with me. And this right here, great deal as well. It comes with, like, dog food stores or whatever. It comes with two. It comes with dog food stores. No. Same thing. Don't have to open that. And it actually low-key tricked me because I thought, like, an emergency kit was already going to be in here. But we have to make our own emergency kit, which is so stupid because they should have said that. But I think this is where I put his name tag in, I think. And then it comes with two fat behind bowls, literally. These are the bowls the size, like, a dumb man can literally eat their food in. Literally. So, if you have a big dog, I suggest you get it. But he's probably not going to use this because it's too big for him. And like I said, he put his toys and stuff up here. And then put this in here. Like this is actually a good, like a great deal. If you have a big dog or two dogs, I suggest you do get this. It comes with a small pocket. And then it's like airplane, like you know, luggage. Same thing, small party, and I think it's one side. Oh yeah, this is the side where you put like his blanket or stuff right here. That's so cute. And then I got his toothbrush, toothpaste, and it comes with this as well. But you just put it in your finger and then put it in his mouth or whatever. So cute. I was like so strict on toothpastes and everything, so I want to make sure I got him the right good toothpaste for him so that's what i got for him oh this is from walmart i forgot this is from walmart y'all gonna judge me probably but i did get him some pacifiers <laughs> i got him some pacifiers because i heard it actually helps with puppy like it actually helps for puppies because they feel like they're sucking on nipple whatever you want to call it because <laughs> i'm trying to like not get flagged but this is his pacifier so hopefully he likes me <laughs> I'm telling y'all, this is my baby. This is my baby. And then I'm gonna try to make not too much noise. But this is bells. Like for like door bells or whatever. I'm gonna put it. I'm put that down. I'm gonna put it right next to my door. So when he, when he well, once he train, I'm gonna make sure like every time he has to use the bathroom outside because like I said I can't take him outside to pee until he's 16 weeks old. So once I train him to go pee outside, he's gonna I'm gonna teach him how to ring the doorbells. So every time he has to pee, he ring the doorbells and let me know that he gotta pee. And then I got this on sale for two for Black Friday. It's, it's a dog carrier which is only gonna be used for vets and plus like. My family members, if they want to dog sit, this can be his own personal car seat. It comes with whatever. And then this is how it looks inside. This is how it looks inside. This is the main reason why I got this, is because look how soft this is. And it's so big, like it's literally, as y'all can tell, it's so big. But I wanted him to have more space because if you're a dog, don't y'all want more space? Because I don't want him to have, like, you know, be feeling in small spaces. But it's so big, but at the end of the day, I want him to feel more comfortable and not be all smushed up. And so I got this for him, and I think that's the, that's the last thing from Amazon that I got. So this is probably gonna be a part two because this video is long. So this might be a part two. I don't know yet. If y'all wanna watch this all the way through, and then I'll just post it. But if not, I might go ahead and just make a part one and a part two. And then I think, last but not least, this is the last thing that I got him. And this is from Chewy. I got him some ear wipes to clean his ears. Gotta make sure you clean your dog's ears. So there's some ear wipes. And I'm not gonna lie, like truly they be having some good deals. Like I have like basically 30 to 40 dollars off because I was a new customer and everything. So I'm actually happy that I purchased this because it's a better deal. 
And then I got this chewy ring. What is this? Oh, it's a chew, it's a chew bone. I said chew ring. It's a chew bone. Chicken flavored. I'm gonna give this to him. And then I got this, um, the high calorie nutrition gel. I heard my breeder recommended this because she said that basically their blood sugar be low sometimes. So you have to make sure that you give them this and put it in their food. Cause especially if he's not eating, make sure you put this in his food or whatever. But this is what I got her. My breeder recommended me getting this. So I made sure I listened to the breeder and got this for him. And plus I seen it in people vlogs as well saying the same thing. And then this is his puppy pad. So I had to make sure I got the fit ones. Cause I love a fresh, good smelling home. So I got this for him. And then this is his treats. I got the Zooks. I heard everybody got this and I heard it was a good treat. But I got this salmon and chickpea recipe puppy edition. It's, I think this, yeah, this is kind of hard. So I might have to cut it up. I don't know. But this is what it got. I heard this is a good brand for um, treats and training treats or whatever. And then last treats I got, because I got them two separate treats. Um, like I said, that one is salmon. And then this one is chicken because his food is basically chicken and rice. So I wanted to make sure he didn't have a lot of chicken flavor because I didn't want to get tired of chicken. So that's why I got that salmon one. And then I got the tasty chicken recipe from Blue Buffalo, which I always wanted to give him these treats ever since I laid my eyes on this. So I got him these treats and plus vet approved. And then last, last but not least, last but not least, his dog food. My reader recommended in this. This is six pounds, and that's the size food that I'm going to be giving him for the rest of his life. Six pounds of diamond naturals, chicken and rice, puppy formula, small and medium. And how to give him this food and everything and i basically have this thursday will be six weeks so this i'm not gonna lie his food stuff i did not know it was gonna arrive so fast so i was not planning on getting it because i wanted to get it anyways because the diamond nachos be sold out on chewy and on amazon sold out they don't even be putting it back in stock until three months later but i didn't know the shipping was gonna be fast so and i told my breeder that but she said it's okay but um yeah um they don't even have that dog food in pet smart or nothing but other than that um that's all it like that's it he's not getting nothing else <laughs> he's not getting nothing else but a collar because that one that I have that I just showed you guys, it might not fit him. But oh, and I do have to get him his wet food. I have to make sure I get that for him or whatever. And then he has one more thing actually coming, which is his pee pad holder. But it's taking so long to come. So I might actually insert a picture right here and show y'all what it looks like. But and then that that's it. That's everything. I'm not getting him no more stuff. I promise. I promise. I promise. Because he's already settled. He already got everything. The only thing I need to get him is probably a new collar and his wet food. And that's it. But other than that, my boy is spoiled. He's not getting nothing for Christmas. And he's most definitely not getting no more toys. <laughs> he's not getting no more toys. Um, I just can't do it. But if you watch this video all the way through, thank you so, so much. And if you're getting a puppy... Congratulations. I know y'all are so excited, just like me. But I pick up my baby in two weeks. And I'm probably going to pick him up on my birthday because his eight weeks is on my birthday. So that's so exciting for me. But yeah, that's all I got for him. And I hope this was a helpful video for you if you're planning on getting a puppy. And like I said, if you're planning on getting a puppy next year, and if you want to shop or you are already shopping for him this year, I'm not gonna judge because like I said, I did the same thing. And like I said, some of the stuff I got him was on sale and they are not in store no more. Like the bed, his bed that I got him with, it's not in store no more. So 
all the stuff that I got him, I don't regret. And yeah, so that's it for today's video. Um, make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. Comment down below what kind of puppy you're getting. And if you want to comment his name, comment their name. But other than that, I'm so excited and I'm so excited for you guys as well if you're getting a puppy. But like I said, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe onto 1K for a giveaway. And I love you guys so much. And stay tuned for me picking my baby up. Bye, y'all.